If 50 is the new 30, the author and nutrition expert Tosca Rito must be a teenager. She's discovered a way to stay healthy and slim by not working out for hours a day. Are you hearing me? And she's not starving herself, but she eats what she calls clean food. Welcome, Tosca. Thanks nice to have you here. Thank so, you. Um, what, what's the premise behind your kind of food? Well, the whole idea behind eating clean is to eat more to weigh less. My backstory is I weighed 204 pounds at my heaviest. What? Yeah, I was a big girl. I was obese. Oh, wow. And beginning to have those diseases that go along with being overweight, you know, the heart disease, lifestyle diabetes. Um, yeah, I was really a sick woman. And I wanted to find a way to make myself look healthy and preserve my youth a little bit so I could be with my kids. I have, mm -hmm. I have four kids. And basically, you know, if you look at the counter here, you can see foods that are clean. They're yes, not absolutely. processed in any great way by uh, manufacturers. They're natural. They're from the earth. Uh, they are whole, nutrient-dense dense foods that no make chemicals. us look and feel amazing. Yeah. So you're saying eat real food eat is real what food. you're saying and avoid yeah. chemicals. It's, it makes common sense. What are we going to make today? So we're going to make some pad thai. Okay. Um, this is my She's favorite. She's got me cooking. Yeah, here we go. This is my favorite cooking fat. It has the highest smoke point. It's the most heat-stable of all the fats. And, and also see. with and Ooh. also with coconut oil. See, it's smoking now. We could probably turn that down a little bit. Also okay. with coconut oil, when it gets hot like that, I'm sure I, you mean put garlic in. Yeah, right? put some yeah. garlic in there. Uh, when it gets hot like this, um, it actually improves the nutritional value. So we can, yeah. Oh, that smells great. Where, Whoa. Yeah, Ooh. that's yummy. That's amazing. You know, if you cooked olive oil this hot, it would oxidize. Yes, and, and butter would do the same yeah. thing. Okay. And manufactured carrots? fats, those right. are not good for you, right? So carrots are going to put in. These are all foods we recognize, right? Mm -hmm. We're making a pad thai. Okay. Go ahead and put those in. Okay. Good job, Suzanne. I think you like to cook. Yeah, I, you know what? I was going to be a chef, and then the, seriously, I, then this show called Three's Company came along and ruined everything. <laughs> Did you cook on Three's Company? <laughs> no, you know what was funny? Um, Jack w yeah. was, was going to chef school, but he had I remember John that. Ritter did not know how to cook it all. These are our zucchini. This is, uh, yeah, just prepared zucchini. It's beautifully yep. cut too. Isn't that nice? I think the way it you cooks cut nicely is important. Anyway, I agree. Uh, Chrissy Snow off amazing. camera was the cooking consultant for Jack Tripper, the chef. Little known fact, nobody knows that. See, I like that. Yeah. Sharing the unknown. Right. That's, that's I'm, now special. what else okay. are we here? So now we're going to put in some. Now, let the rest, this is pretty easy. This uh -huh. is just going to turn color, see? Right. Um, we're also going to add... Well, green let's, onion? Let's, let's put some green onion in. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Right. And then that just... Yeah. Well, you don't overcook things. You right. retain most of the nutritional value, right? right? And this is So we're like going to put delicious. some... Bean sprouts. sprouts in. Yep. Also, we need to just give them a little flash in the pan. Okay. I say we like to heat their bum a little bit. That's right. it. <laughs> give right. Banking. Yeah, you want that right. crunch still left in. Right. Now, now you're going to put some uh, egg white in there. This is egg there. white. That's okay. your protein. Okay. Clean eating also wants you to eat lean protein and complex carbs okay. together. So we're just going to actually just give that a flash. Quickly stir so it around so it's almost, not a big lump. Yeah, like yeah. an egg foo yum yeah. kind of yeah. thingy. Right I don't on. notice any salt here. Where's your salt? Well, you know, I don't cook with a lot of salt, but when uh -huh. I do, it's unrefined sea, sea, sea salt. salt. So you right. have all okay. the minerals and nutrients because okay. you don't want to eat. Do you know there's 92 minerals and elements in unrefined sea salt? But in regular table salt, there's only two, sodium and chloride. A little bit of sugar to keep it free running, some bleach and all that. And then so, they take the minerals out of the uh, table salt yeah. and sell it to us in little Pills. capsule forms yeah, so to take can, minerals. So we, we just get eat crazy sea with salt if you're going to eat. That's how you exactly. get a lot of your minerals. All right, okay, so some the cilantro. varnish really is some cilantro, but we can throw that in there. I like the flavor of it. I do too. Do you know that um, there's a genetic quality in people that some people like cilantro and that the other percentage of the population hates it because it tastes like soap? Do you know um, Barry Manilow is my best friend, Aww. and he hates cilantro, Cause it, cause so it he's tastes got like that soap. genetic You're thing. Right. Now I get it. Right, I so now just, just a little sauce and Call him adventurous. And... <laughs> <laughs> call, call, him, call him really good at what he does. This is smelling really good. He, Isn't that uh, nice? He's, he's pretty great at what he does. So technically pad thai can be whatever's in your vegetable drawer. Just, you know, shred it up nicely and right. cook it in the Now what like are these this. noodles? So these are rice noodles. Uh -huh. right? So this and is good for people who are, who are gluten, gluten intolerant, intolerant right. like my right. husband. Right. Okay. So now we're going to throw this in here. Um, we're going to toss it up a little bit, warm mm. it up. What is it about noodles? Noodles. Comfort food. Yeah, noodles yeah. make everybody happy. Feel, feel good, right? What do, You're what doing do you a want great more? job, Suzanne, but standing here beside you, it smells fantastic. It smells fantastic. Smell and what was, I'm, you know, I was talking 
as I tend to do, and you put in the, the what is oh, the brown sauce? the tamarind, a little bit of molasses okay. that has a little note okay. of sweetness. That's why you don't um, need the salt. I'm not the neatest cook, as you can see. I matter, spill around. Th this is very neat. Look what okay. you did here. Right, right. <laughs> this is the finished product. Okay. <laughs> I like molasses because it too, especially on salted yeah. molasses, Doesn't that has. Look good? It's good? It's wonderful. Now, what is this here? Okay, so this is a turkey burger with, with a, a topping of guacamole, which yeah. is your avocado. So mm. that's also healthy fats, mm -hmm. lean protein. You've got your carbohydrate from the tomato. Now, what is this? Okay, so this is a smoothie, strawberry smoothie. I do a lot of smoothies. Mm -hmm. I start my mornings with and smoothies. And what is in this? Okay, in this one, there's strawberry, there's yogurt. I always put flaxseed in because flaxseed to me is that beautiful thing that gives you some fiber, some mm -hmm. essential fatty acids cleans out your digestive Yum. tract. It's like a good scrubbing for your digestive tract. What are these? Okay, these are banana cupcakes with peanut butter frosting. Yum. Gluten-free? They are gluten-free. So all of these things are clean foods. We right. haven't used processed ingredients. Certainly I've never used sugar. Sugar, in my mind, is right up there with heroin and cocaine. Well, you know, and in the cancer world, they say mm -hmm. the one thing that cancer can't live without is sugar. Sure. This is all really <laughs> fascinating and delicious. Thank you. And um, what's your website? My website is eatcleandiet.com or toscarino.com. And you can find all these recipes in Clean Eating Magazine, Oxygen Magazine, or the Eat Clean Diet books. You make a lot of sense. <laughs> you know your stuff. You're in tune with what's going on in the universe. I really appreciate having you here. Thank, Thank you. you. Great food. Try this food. We'll be back.